So now we'll see how we can change Lenovo Legion 5. The first thing we'd like to do is to type the correct number of the laptop or either the serial number in Google to check its specifications. So from here we can grab the correct uh, processor number as well as what is capable of running. So for example, the memory settings as well as uh, for the storage. Then we need to unscrew all the bolts. Uh, be careful when opening uh, the laptop because some of the bolts are actually uh, smaller than the rest. And if you try to force longer bolts into small holes, uh, it might puncture or create certain uh, bumps on the chassis. So we're keeping them in a container, not to lose them. And then with either a card or musician pick, or just with nails, we are trying to open up the laptop. It needs a little bit of attention. And you need just to apply a little bit of uh, pressure. Sooner or later, it will open. So when ready, we just remove the cover. And now the first thing is to remove the battery because it might introduce some unwanted uh, electricity while we are changing the sensitive parts. So after this is done, we need uh, to remove the shielding over the hard drives. So we're unscrewing the metal plate. And now it's time to reveal the place of the hard drive. Actually, this is the SSD from Samsung 980 that we're gonna place on the empty slot. There is one bolt used for fastening and holding it tight. So we remove it and then we'll place it back. Actually, if you're producing video content, one terabyte might be not exactly enough. So you can think of a bigger size, especially if the content is in 4K resolution recorded. Then we screw everything back. And now it's time for the memory. The memory is located under this uh, protective uh, metal sheet. And 
we need to apply a little bit of force in order to pull it up from all sides. So again, be careful. And after a few trials, you can uh, remove the panel. So as you can see, first it opens on one side and then we are trying very gently to open all the other sides. And here is the default memory on this laptop. It's uh, two slots of eight gigabytes. Now we'll remove them by gently pulling back the RAM holders and removing the RAM out of the slots. The same we'll do with the other Now the replacement we've chosen crucial for this laptop. Um, so we just unpack it because it's uh, compatible with the uh, RAM speeds. And uh, of course, be careful how you place it so to fit. And when ready in the slot, you need to press down until the two holders are locked in place. Then again, very gently, we are placing the the metal protector and we are almost ready. And finally, before placing the cover, we just plug the battery on. And that was the whole procedure. So once everything clicks into its place, we can screw back the bolts. And enjoy the improved performance of the laptop.